Okay, let's take a look at the third update to the Internet Explorer 9 platform preview and some of the samples that we released on the updated test drive site. In this first sample, we're looking at uh, our, the support that we added for the HTML5 video tag that we built together with the IMDB uh, Internet Movie Database. And here you can scroll through samples of HTML5 videos. Nice, smooth animation. And you can hover and click over a video and it begins to play using the HTML5 video tag without any other add-ons or extensions uh, installed. Let's take a look at another sample. In this sample, we show the support that we added for CSS3 font face and WAF web open font format support so designers can bring high quality fonts into their web pages. Let's take a look at this in another browser. Here you have the same same page opened up in Chrome and you can see the difference uh, that having high quality fonts makes in terms of the quality and look of the page. Let's take a look at another demo. This demo shows the support that we added for HTML5 Canvas. And like all the graphics in, H in IE9, the support for Canvas is hardware accelerated through the GPU. And so here you have some fish swimming on the screen as animated images, and I can increase the number of fish in the tank, 100, 250 fish swimming around, and I get a nice steady animation at 60 frames per second. Let's take a look at this in another browser. I'm opening the same page here in uh, Firefox, and you can see as the fish are swimming around the tank, you're getting a slightly slower frame rate. If we increase the number of fish, the frames per second goes down and you get a slower animation. Let's take a look at another sample. Here's another example of an application we built together with Amazon. In this sample, you see books coming from the Amazon's web service for the best-selling books at Amazon. And I can scroll through uh, the books using the mouse, clicking on the button, using the scroll wheel, I can click on a book and open it up. I can see information about the book. I can see reviews from other readers. I can even go and purchase the book on Amazon if I like. Let's take a look at another sample. There's been a lot of excitement around browser performance and potato guns, and so we wanted to do our part, and we built a sample here, again, using HTML5 Canvas. And so here, when I click shoot, the potato flies through the potato gun and the pieces are animated bouncing around on the screen. And the score that you see on the right is accumulated based on the amount of anim animation based on frames per second that the demo is able to, to uh, output on the screen. Let's take a look at this in, in another browser. Here you see that same demo uh, opened up in Google Chrome and shooting the potato out on the screen, you see a lower frames per second and a lower overall accumulated score as a result. And this just shows the difference between rendering through the GPU and hardware acceleration. Going back to IE, we'll try that again because it's so much fun. So these are just a few of the samples that you can try out for yourself on the IE9 uh, test drive site. I encourage you to download the latest version of the platform preview and experience this for yourself. Thanks.